What is up, Aquarius? I've been meaning to get this message out because we really have to reflect on what we do. You know, I should have been came on YouTube. YouTube is better than TV. Like, you can just come to YouTube and you can watch Days of Our Lives. You definitely can watch The Young and the Restless. You can just watch, like, it's just crazy. Like, this retrograde has been so interesting. And you just like... And you got people that's young that can't even start channels. And you got older people that's got channels. And they just like, it is what it is. I've been wanting to do this message, um, the karma, karmic justice. Because, and I wrote my notes so you'll see me looking down. So that way I won't leave nothing out because I would not be using no cards. I don't need cards to talk to y'all, okay? Let's come on in. My name is Spiritual Star 111. Come on in like y'all in the live. Well, just come on in. Um, Spiritual Star 111. Um, this is for whoever needs to hear this. I mainly speak for the Aquarians, but if you're not an Aquarian, you're a cross watcher and you need to hear this, then it definitely relate, um, can relate to you. Only take what resonates with this message. Do not make a story fit. If this is not you and you know you do not do anything, then don't, don't put a story where it fits, okay? But I know this fits because everybody does this. There's no, you can't sit there and say, I'm perfect Nancy or perfect Patty because you done done some type of karma in your life or you done done it to somebody else and you may not even realize it, okay? Um, As I was doing the angel number message, that's when I decided to do this message because this makes perfect sense. We sit here and we wish bad judgment or karma on someone, right? And I had brought this up in one of my lives long time ago, but I need to put it as a message because I have a different type of following when I do live and a different type of following when I do messages. A lot of us Aquarians, we don't like to hear stuff, right? Because we're a fixed sign, but I'll get to that. But have you ever wondered? Hold on. Okay, y'all. Sorry. I'm getting something done to my house. So, okay. But have you ever wondered, have you ever paid your debt to society, to spirit? Have There's no two perfect people in the world, but have you ever paid your karma to spirit while you're wishing karma on somebody else? I wait. Hear me out. It's the age of the Aquarius. We not only have to rebuild our image, but we have to set an example, okay? We are given this opportunity with the age of the Aquarius to not only do better, but be better, right? Now, like I was saying, Aquarians, we are stubborn. We are fixed signs. You can't tell us nothing. You say what? Who? Um. So you had to ask yourself, have you paid your karmic debt to spirit? Have you asked spirit to cleanse you or forgive you of your wrongdoings? This is what I wrote. I am not talking about childhood issues. Okay. See, you didn't know any better when you was a child. I'm talking about adulthood issues. As I've gone through my spiritual awakening and spiritual awakening and spiritual awakening, it teaches me something every retrograde. Um, I receive a new beginning, not only did my heart, because for those who do not know, I had open heart surgery in 2017. Not only did my heart get fixed, I got renewed. So, see, I want to be with the aquas that are growing and that are smiling and high vibrational, not bitter, not mad, not depressed, overcoming that experience. We can overcome it together. Um, being able to talk about our wrongdoings and taking actions for our, or taking responsibility for our actions. Being able to talk about the past and laugh it off like, um, 
Not only do we have to do better, but we have to be better, Aquarius. We are a fixed sign. We are the shit. That is true. But at the same time, we have to carry ourselves. We can't keep going through each cycle. You know what I'm saying? Like, if, if this doesn't resonate with you, then that's cool. But sometimes we have to take fault in our responsibility. And then you wonder why somebody either left you, ghosted you, or don't want to be with you. Because we're a fixed sign. All right? So don't be mad at spirit because of what you go through. Spirit is not trying to break you. Spirit is trying to mold you. It's like fix it, Ralph. Fix it, Aquarius. Fix it, Juanita. And as I get older and as I see these YouTube channels, these reaction channels, I do not want to be that person. I do not want to come on here and be a person to where I hate people or I just hate a specific person. Even though people are not going to like me and that's cool. I get it. Nobody is putting this earth, to earth or put in this life to sit here and like everybody and, you know, be everybody's friend. But as I'm growing and as I'm becoming and as I'm ascending, and I keep telling y'all, you have to drop that bitterness. You have to, you have to pay your karmic, your karma to spirit and stop worrying about somebody else's karma. Hmm. You have to actually. Take responsibility and ask spirit to cleanse you of what you done done. Whether it was in a relationship, whether it was to a sibling, what well, well, not when you're young, I'm talking about older, now that you're older, or whether it was to whoever. Now, if you didn't do anything cool, but I know you done done something that you regret. You can't sit here and tell me you haven't. You cannot. I done done stuff that I regret. I done cheated on people. Mm-hmm. I didn't see here and said stuff that I shouldn't say. Am I a saint? No. But at the same time, I'm accepting responsibility for what I need to do. And that's what Retrograde is here to teach you. And you see these YouTube streets is crazy. Not even so much in the tarot community. It may be a little, but I'm talking about in the reaction channels. They are like crazy. Like they better than TV. I do not want to grow older. What's what somebody done done to me? I don't want to grow older being mad and being miserable. I want to grow older. Not only do I want to glow, but I want to shine. I want to see here and have that smile. Come here and be able to talk to you. You know, I'm speaking in existence. As this retrograde is getting ready to come to an end, because you know tomorrow is it, it moves from Aquarius back to Capricorn. You need to ask yourself. I'm sitting here watching YouTube, worrying about somebody else's karma, but have I paid my karma debt to spirit? This is not going to resonate with everybody because once again, Aquarius is our fixed signs. They don't want to hear their wrongs. They don't want to hear all they want to know is that they're right. But you have to learn to take back that control. You have to grow mind, body, and soul. You have to ask spirit to cleanse you. You can detox all you want to. But have you cleansed your soul, not your body? I can get deep with y'all. I really can. But you have to do the inner work. And now that I'm getting older and I'm um, gaining knowledge and I'm learning, I'm learning not to only, maybe it's the blue candle that's keeping me calm. I don't know. Maybe you get you a blue candle. I'm becoming more calm. Yeah, I can do little messages, you know, make y'all laugh, make y'all be like, yeah, you right. But at the same time, we can laugh too. We can do messages based on our ex and we can still laugh. You can watch my message and go and be like, okay, yeah, yeah, Star was right. But you know what? I ain't mad at him. I ain't mad at her. Don't let somebody have that much power over you. You're not perfect either. They're not perfect. You're not perfect. Nobody's perfect. And even though you may have been perfect in that relationship, you done done something. You can't tell me you have, and I can sit here and read you, give you a reading, and tell you. Um. Also, if I text you, what's your YouTube name? When you send me a, a, a donation or a reading and you do not respond, I would take it as a donation because it's a lot of funny energy out here, especially for people from California. 
So you from California, I need to know your YouTube name because I won't read you. I'll send you to another, I'll send you to my sister and she can read you. Because I know it's people in California that play games. And I don't have time. I'm not saying all people in California, just to get it right. But just ask yourself, and I don't want that extra energy, but just ask yourself, have I paid my karmic debt to spirit? When I did karmic justice, it wasn't so much karmic justice to where I was saying somebody else, like, wishing bad on somebody else. I was just saying all the bullshit that you've been through, you can breathe this year. It's the age of the Aquarius. You can breathe. You can take a deep breath and breathe. Spirit is going to bless you. No matter who done done you wrong, you can just breathe. You see the angels are clearing it. That's what the message was today. They're clearing all that bad energy. So don't ever for a second think that when I get on here and do messages based on whoever, that I'm still hurting because I'm healed. I'm healed and I'm glad to say I'm healed. I didn't ask spirit to forgive me for whatever sins that I have done or cleanse me or whatever I have done. Take what take away anything that I have done to hurt somebody. Because I didn't done stuff too. I'm not perfect. You're not perfect. We're not perfect. We're not put on this earth to be perfect. We're put on this earth to grow and to learn and to be better. And as we go into this new world for the ones that have actually ascended, we have to not only do better, but we have to be better. We have to represent Aquarius and stand the fuck up and represent Aquarius. We're the longest sign that has been on this earth. While we keep going through the same cycles, the same bullshit, you can change it. All the other signs, they look to us like y'all done been here the longest. Why y'all acting like this? Or maybe they don't know. Now you know. Why you think it's always a retrograde in an Aquarius? Or why do you think it's always a moon in an Aquarius? Or why do you think it's always um some type of energy dealing with Aquarius? Finding in your spirits to like, comment, and subscribe. I love each and every one of y'all, but we have to take responsibility for our own actions and we have to keep moving. Stay high vibrational. Stay blessed. Have a great day. Smile. Put a smile on somebody else's face. All right? Namaste, y'all.